guys what's happening everyone it's your boy here Durahim. we are back again today with another great amazing android apps of september as some of you guys all know each month we roll out android apps and this month of september has some amazing kind of applications you just have to check them out now for further talking or further ado grab your popcorn you already know what it is and so as we can just get started throughout this video of the day so starting with our first application of the month we're going to be starting with true shot now i understand there are a lot of people you're using screenshots but you're not talking them really really greatly i mean you just have to take a little bit of a screenshot in a professional way now how do you do it let me teach you guys how you do it first thing first you can see on the app when it's open you just have to find your screenshot where it is now let me say i'm gonna go back to my home screen and i'm gonna grab a screenshot right now now since we're having that screenshot i'm gonna go back to the app and open uh, our attachment i'm gonna open my screenshot so i can design my screen radius how much i want it the way you know the appearance and when you're done you can even squeeze throughout padding a little bit giving it more spacing and another thing you can set some shadows and you can even you know use your hand freehand to utilize on your screenshot another kind of stuff we are having multiple background in here there are free backgrounds as you can see we are applying one background in here on our screenshot to give it an amazing feel when you're done you can even share your screenshot just like that or save your screenshot but just know that it will come with a watermark if you purchase the application you can get a fully working application which you can unlock bunch and bunch of background as you can see guys in here but there are free background in here which they're really really cool and you can just still continue using them and enjoy and explore throughout your screenshot app which is really really a brilliant idea our second app of the list is called app bar now what's so good about app bar it's all about how you can utilize on your home screen now let me say you're having your new app bar now you set set in here you select your apps and uh whenever you just select your apps which you want, want to use let me say i'm gonna select behance and i'm gonna pick bike map and i'm gonna use CapCut and uh camera and i'm gonna use chrome now when i'm done i'm gonna just add my application in here and i can say save apps now you can select within widget mode now do you need it to be grid you know grid the way it is or do you just need stack view or you just need list view now i prefer uh, something like a list view so as you can understand how it works perfectly now you can select your icon packs like i have my icon packs in here or if you want nothing icon packs it's really cool you can add uh you can add the size of your icon packs throughout here and another kind of stuff you can hide the labels if you want to and when you're okay with it place on your home screen and add automatically and it will press it here on the home screen not press it but it will add on the home screen now i'm going to resize it up to somewhere here and i'm going to keep it just somewhere there so i can scroll my uh up applications our third application of the list it's a weather app it's called sunny now sunny gives you a little bit an amazing kind of layout looking of minimalistic of weather now i understand there are too much weather application out there but sunny got you covered you can see here it tells you where i'm at and it shows you where the scattered clouds they are and it gives you really really great and amazing kind of feel throughout the application so you won't hesitate throughout that you're gonna just enjoy throughout the application and it's really really cool so that is called sunny you can tweak around some settings you can change some dark theme if you want to and this is how light theme looks like but uh if you want a dark theme looks more great you can add extra i think extra location in here you can add throughout here and it's really coming in handy so when it's in the daylight it will show you sun and when it's at night it shows you a little bit of breezy like a uh, cloudy and moon and sometimes when it's raining it's going to show you the rain so it's really really an amazing kind of application which i find it it's really dope our fourth application of the list is called by the name of cup cut now i understand a lot of you guys usually edit on the go throughout your phone and cup cut is the most an amazing kind of application i've been using Using it for a while and to be honest it has never ever disappoints me because everything is at handy instead of you paying for a lot of application like in short for a subscription well you can use CapCut for free and you can utilize everything possible really really cool now let's jump in on the application now as you can see in the application comes really greatly you can start by camera if you tap on the camera section you can start using the camera built-in for CapCut 
and other kind of stuff you can use retouch you can do captions you can auto cut now auto cut it's a really great thing for the people who like just to have a lot of clips and they just want everything attended without them doing a lot of stuff now how does it work let me show you guys now just jump in here i have some few clips in here i've took a shot today so i'm gonna select these kind of shots of uh, gopro just like that and uh, just like this one, like this one too, like this one too. And uh, just like that, just go to next. And when you're done, it will just analyze the clips. And when it's done, actually 100%, it will show you that it's <laughs> it's done completely. Guys, yeah, so right now it's time for magic because it has done the process already. Just tap on play, as you can see, it's playing and it's really, really cool. You can see it did a lot of magic for you instead of you doing anything and it's really, really sparking amazing. Just like that, you have created an amazing kind of auto cut video, but it doesn't mean that you can edit, you can still edit if you want to. Say edit more, you see there's a button say editing more, so it will take you to the edit panel. Right inside the edit panel, you can see what you can edit and you can remove, or you can even add more transition on your video, and it's really, really cool. So that's how you use the CapCut application and it's really, really cool. Our fifth app of the list is called ZigZag. Now I understand what do you mean by saying ZigZag Abdul. Now ZigZag, it's an application for your wallpaper. Now this is just all about moving wallpaper and it's a live wallpaper. Now it's just a lot and bunch of uh, ZigZag stuff going on on your screen. And as you can see guys, it's really great, really great. You can just set your wallpaper in here and uh, just like that, you can tap on preview to see how much it looks like. And if you're interested throughout that, you can just set apply uh, both wallpaper of uh, home screen and even the lock screen. And another kind of stuff, you can say get aquarium if you'd like just to get an aquarium or depending on you what you want to. You can see get ocean aquarium. That means you can customize, you can do bunch and bunch of stuff in here, which is really, really great thing. You can add more FPS or I think 60 FPS is the last FPS for it which is quite no bad and uh yeah just like that guys you're good to go and that's your zigzag application and i kind of love it because it gives me that kind of vibe of uh, animation our sixth app of the list is called wallman now wallman it's a really great and amazing application because it gives you all those vibes of google pixel wallpapers i know there are a lot of you guys have different variety of phones let me say oneplus or let me say you're using um what is it realme or you're using xiaomi now those kind of devices they don't have the pixel wallpapers they have their own kind of wallpapers now wallman comes in handy you just select what type of wallpaper you'd like even the live ones they work perfectly and when you're done just select your wallpaper you can have dynamic or static like this one i just prefer having only static and when done i'll apply and it will just do the everything on the go which it's a really really brilliant brilliant idea through all this application so you get all those vibes when you go back to the home screen right now you can see our wallpaper has been applied and it's really really dope our last but not least application is called picklet now picklet it's a game and it's a really really amazing game now we're going to just see here our pickle and uh, it's called pickle picked and uh, what he does, he shoots a lot of enemies in there. And it's a really, really great game. You just have to kill your enemies, make sure that you eliminate all the enemies. That's our pickle, because if you don't do that, you'll just die on the game. So the more game it goes, it gives you many, many uh, waves. It's like plants versus zombies game, you know? And it's just the same, same vibes. And you can even uh, swing around. You can get some mobilities, like abilities, you see? what's going on in here they it's a lot of uh pickles in here so you just have to kill them and the one having it like a bag and you have just to pick these pickles he's just having some something which you can grab throughout him this guy here you can see this guy here he just you just do the thing so what's up guys about top android apps of september let me know in the comments down below which is an amazing app captured you mostly throughout this application they're really really great to be honest for me i kind of love the game pickle pet it's a really great and amazing game another thing which i like it the zigzag or live wallpaper it's a really decent one and last but not least all the applications are really good depending on you now which suits you best but all the applications that are really top notch is up to you guys to select which is the best application you like and another kind of stuff guys before we wrap up things 
uh, if you didn't check out the last month Android apps, well, definitely you can click on the end of this video. And another kind of great and amazing thing, let me know in the comments down below if you guys would like productivity apps of the top of the week. So I was dropping those videos and a lot of you guys, I asked you if you're interested on that so as I can share with you guys and it would be really amazing. But I'll still be making it, but I would like just to get some info throughout to you guys. What do you recommend best? So as you can see on the next uh, weekly based Android app. So that's what's up guys. Up to on the next one. It's your boy here, Abdurrahim13. Catch you guys on the next Android apps of the month. Peace.